Aww, Aww, geek, geek out. out! Pinky's up. Time for another Geek Out Book Club. I'm Sam. I'm Jake. Uh, this week we're going to be talking about Maestro is by Steve Scross out in uh, comic book stores everywhere and on Comixology on Wednesday, October 18th through Image Comics. Jake, what do you think of the book? Mm. It is a fucking wild time. <laughs> yeah. uh, psychedelic, man. If there's it, ever a psychedelic comic we've read, this yeah. is probably... It. Yeah, man. And it's one of those things where there are some splash pages of like time and magic and things where I'm like, I hope we find out about that shit because there is some wild stuff going having, on. Having read some of the second issue, mm-hmm. yeah, there you get... Well, I mean, yeah, I'm assuming it's, it's there, but um, holy moly. Yeah, it's very... I mean, there's multiple worlds. There is like... It, the, the book hits the ground running. It starts out with... And I, this is on all the preview pages, so I don't think I'm spoiling anything necessarily. It starts out with a massacre. Mm-hmm. And it's, oh yeah, yeah, <laughs> yeah. and uh, yeah. There's I mean, and I was always struck by the sense of humor that's in this book too. Yeah, yeah that's there. Um, so there are very ambitious, you know, multiple time periods, multiple worlds, and I like that. I like you know, be bold, motherfucker. <laughs> yeah, the use of color in this is like it's prodigious. Yes. Um, you know, and Steve Scross, he doesn't just write it; he also draws the thing. Hell and yeah, it baby. looks yeah. There are some like landscapes, and there are some action sequences that just like. That, that truly are just like jaw dropping. Yeah, and it's really interesting to see this kind of. So you're following this protagonist who finds out that he's basically inherited like all of magic, mm-hmm. and it's you know the series is kind of kind of explore how he reacts to that and how magic reacts to him. And uh, again, it really does hit the ground running. Really pulls you in. It's got a sense of a really good sense of humor about itself. There's penises, which is always a you know a plus. There is a <laughs> penis. <laughs> <laughs> the whole time, like I grunted at the beginning of this because I was stopping myself from just going penis, <laughs> <laughs> which was nice. Yeah, yeah. And again, it's a nice book. Out in and com- it's it's like played really fucking hilariously. Yeah. Again, it's played for laughs. Um, <laughs> and the rationale behind it, is <laughs> of course, of course. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> again, this book- yeah, it's not a serious penis. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. a serious penis. An angry, p- the angriest penis in Brooklyn. Oh, <laughs> don't fuck with him. <laughs> <laughs> the uh, though it takes place, that sequence takes place in Florida. Regardless, the um, you know, it, it's it's a fun book. It's an ambush book. It's this book's out of its mind. We love it. Yeah. Uh, out in comic book stores everywhere. Wednesday, October eighteenth. Stay tuned tomorrow because we have an interview with steve all about it this is another geek out book club i'm sam i'm pete Pete, uh jake (laughs) keep reading (laughs) this has been another geek out production if you enjoyed what you heard hey you know we've got a special episode every friday of course there's the usual catching up show every wednesday and you get book club episodes just about every tuesday these days thanks for listening